This video was not filmed by me, and it will only be on in its entirety on my Patreon channel. Well, I cut this video down from over an hour down to 37 minutes because I cut all the boobies out. If you want to see the boobies, and there's lots of that and a lot more. This was back in the days when it was wild out there in Sturgeon, South Dakota. So if you want to see all that, you're going to have to watch the rest of these videos, the full video, on Patreon channel. I'll have this one cut up into a little over 10 minute segments, and I'll throw it on there as previews for what will be coming on the long version, full version, over an hour, on Patreon. Stay tuned. Sturgis, South Dakota, the home of the world's most famous motorcycle rally. Over 100,000 bikers from all around the country and around the world gather to see everything from bike shows to drag racing. But what everyone really comes for is to get down and get wild for one of the best parties of the year anywhere in the world. Parties of Sturgis takes you behind the scenes to some of the less publicized events, the Buffalo Chip Campground, as well as a look at the people who really make it happen. Give me your name. Susan. I'm from Bend, Oregon. Hi, I'm Stacy, and I'm from Wichita, Kansas. <laughs> where am I? Where am I from? Texas. <laughs> I don't know where I'm from. I'm in Sturgis, man. <laughs> right. We forget where we're at. <laughs> I suppose you don't even you don't even look at your watch when you're here. No, I have no idea what time it is. No, I don't care. I don't give a shit what time it is. <laughs> give me a name where you're from. Oh man, you should have seen that baby right over there a while ago. She's walking out and had one of them little body suits on and got on them little cutout places. I thought my pacemaker was going to blow on the spot. There's titties everywhere. That's the only reason I come to Sturgis. What do you like about the Harley man? Well, what do you think? What do you like about the women? Uh, the tits mostly, of course. So you're a boo man? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This is an adult video. What do you think of Harley man? Say again? I am definitely a Sturgis slut. Are you a Sturgis slut? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you like the Harley man? Yeah. What do you like? Uh, be honest. So you're a tit man? Yes, I am a tit man. <laughs> what the vibration does the Harley do for you? Yeah. Oh, they make me so hot. How about you, Deb? Oh my God. <laughs> There's nothing like a Harley. This will kill her son if you ever see this on here. I would never do that. Out, frisky. She really is. This is only a medium. <gasps> Don't you show that on the video. He said to give you an idea how frisky she is, that's just a medium. We are willing to have an orgasm going 65. <laughs> Come and find us. And we want to have orgasms with those two girls doing 65 miles an hour. We get today in the newspaper. Big, big, big sky. It was disgusting. I like this. Big sky. All right. Thanks a lot. That's my girlfriend. Do you like the Harley men? I've never dated one, no. I don't have any serious plans on it either. What would you like to see the most on a bike video? Tits. What are you afraid of? Tell me, what was she afraid of? Well, I left her in the room for a few minutes when some friends of mine showed up. Told her she was going to be packed off and uh, <laughs> molested and all this good stuff. I come back and she would totally changed clothes and wasn't going anywhere. <laughs> and it was like... I told her, I've been here for 24 years, I've never had anything happen to me, nothing but a good time. And if you don't have a good time, it's your own fault. I'm here for a Kawasaki convention, and I just can't find it. That guy got a couple dicks with me, you know? We're just hanging out. Are you easy? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I'm lost. Oh, God, it's so true. There's women, there's beer, there's bikes. We got it covered. Well, I've heard about it for years. It was uh, this one in Daytona, or the two that set me a notch above the rest, you know? You make these two parties, you make them fucking all. You're in there. That's what I'm going for. PLD, brother. What'd you come up to Sturgis for this year? To party. This is the place to party. They need to leave the chip alone. One of the best places for parties, booze, and entertainment is the Buffalo Chip Campground just outside of town. The campground owned by mild-mannered Belfouche lawyer Rod Woodruff 
and has been the center of controversy since it opened up over 10 years ago. Ever since the city officials chased the parties out of the park, many of them headed out for the chip for some of the best nightly big name rock groups in the world, including the infamous Miss Buffalo Chip Contest. The city police refused to offer the campground protection, so the chip has its own security. Real working cowboys from nearby ranches. City officials have constantly put pressure on the campground to clean up its act. The contest has been reduced to a wet t-shirt contest and officials have taken away the liquor license. But that still hasn't stopped the fun at the chip. People bring their own booze and a party on as usual.
I'm from Mechanicsville, Virginia, outside of Richmond. And I'm this Virginia. Buffalo chip, I guess. 1992. 1992. <laughs> Didn't give me a damn banner. The Buffalo chip is nothing like it was at the much ballyhooed 50th anniversary Sturgis run when over 300,000 crowds were wild too, man. One night over 40,000 showed up to see the Bachman Turner Overdrive concert. You ready out there? Are you ready out there? Always be remembered and talked about as one of the best parties ever during the 50th anniversary Sturgis rally. But another great place to have some fun is Deadwood, South Dakota, home of Wild Bill Hiccup. After riding through some of the most beautiful canyons anywhere, you arrive into town known for its past colorful western characters. Prostitution and gambling have always been a part of its past until it was halted in the 1970s. But today gambling is legal again, and if you feel lucky, you might win a few bucks, but everyone seems to bitch about losing. I hate Deadwood. I come here all the time, I lose all my money. I just lost big bucks. <laughs> Down my last nickel, I gotta borrow money to get home. I like it better when I win. Have you, know, have you won any money yet since you've been up here? No. The center of action seems to be the stockade, where riding your bike through the bar is one of the crowd-pleasing activities. It's also the quickest way to get to the bathroom. <laughs> so what do you think of Deadwood compared to Sturgis? Better. Why? Why? It's crazier. 